should be nicer yeah. for them, right? I think so, yeah. This system should be gone by then. Oh, we'll good. get our temperatures up there a little bit, too, by Sunday, the way things look. Uh, not the case right now. Take a look at Silverthorne. We have snow going on up there. Wet roads there, but from time to time, they get a good push of snow coming through that really brings down uh, the conditions for driving. So winter driving conditions will be getting worse uh, through the night tonight. There's a live look, as you saw, of our library camera. If you look real close out here back in the foothills, that's where we're starting to see some rain build up, and that'll be moving into the city later tonight. We're not going to get a good washout or anything like that, but we'll get a few sprinkles going by uh, during the uh, afternoon and evening tonight. Temperatures right now, you could really make out where the front is. If you look up here in Kimball, it's 49, 49 in Cheyenne, 33 in Laramie, 41 in Steamboat, 37 in Craig. That's where the front is right there. Ahead of it, most of the temperatures are in the 60s, like DIA, 67. Lyman's at 70. It's 70 down to the southeast. So the front is kind of just scooching right across the northern side of the state. And you can see the snow still starting to pile up in the mountains. It is going to get heavier and heavier as we go through the afternoon here. So if you are planning to leave and go into the high country, get a jump on the weekend, plan to be facing that snow as it's coming through. And a lot working on our weather map. We have a push of moisture coming from the southwest here. Here's the front coming through. And then at altitude, there's a 150 mile per hour jet going up several hundred thousand feet or several thousand feet, I should say, up into the atmosphere as high as jets fly, just blowing through here, what we call a jet streak. And that's helping to lift up all of that moisture and lift up uh, all of the unsettled weather here. So all of that coming together now. All right, let's take a look now at the future cast into tonight and tomorrow. The front will be sliding through snow, ramping up in the mountains here tonight. And then after about midnight, it starts to pull away. The front moves through. High pressure starts to move in out from the west. Then we have clearing skies, so it looks like a sunny weekend. Tomorrow, though, will start out kind of cool, and then the warmth will come in on Sunday. So here's the future cast with the snow. I wanted to show you this because it does point out a couple little rain showers coming through Denver this afternoon on in tonight, the, into tonight. That's the map at 9 o'clock this evening, and then we clear out overnight. should lead to a sunny Saturday, so we're looking pretty good. High temperatures today before everything happens, 60s and 70s here in the east, 40s and 50s in the mountains, and a few 60s popping out there out west. My forecast now, up to 30, 40 mile per hour winds still blowing out there. 47 tomorrow, but the sun will be shining. And there's that Bronco Sunday, 60 degrees, sunshine, warm day on Monday at 63, and then about 50 on Tuesday as we turn it down a little colder. So it's going to be windy this afternoon, a few sprinkles here in town, but the snow is really still ramping up in the high country. Oh, it's amazing. We need it, though. We've been dry. We have been indeed. Thank you mm -hmm. so much, Dave.